Asalaamu Alaikum guys, welcome to Smile to Jannah. A famous footballer, sorry a bit of spit came out. A famous footballer, cleaning the toilets. What's going on mate? Footballers, normally associated with money, partying, girls, all that sort of stuff. Seldom do you hear of footballers doing stuff like this. I mean why on earth is he cleaning the toilets? Well those of you that don't know Sadio Mane is indeed a Muslim football player and in Islam one of the most despised qualities to Allah is that of ego and pride. It's said in a narration that someone with even a little bit of pride will not be entering paradise. Scholars of the past in order to get rid of pride because obviously with knowledge comes fame. So what they would do is in secrecy, they would do acts that were outwardly disgraceful. Now of course the scholars of the past they would do in secret but because Allah wanted it to be a lesson for other people someone would catch them doing it. It's the same with Sadio Mane, it's clear that he hasn't got some photographer or some cameraman standing on the side. I mean the guy who's recording looks like he's recording from a toaster or something mate. When a believer lowers themselves in front of Allah, Allah raises them in the eyes of the people and that is exactly what is happening to our brother right here and I think it's very important that we encourage and we spread stuff like this. Why? So it encourages our youngsters who are very narcissistic, very me, very I based, iPhone, iPlayer, iPod, iTunes, yeah me, me, me. You take a selfie, a selfie self, me mate, me. Yes, so how do you curb that whole selfish, egocentric, selfish nature? You gotta lower yourself. Some way scholars do this is when no one's watching at night, prostrate. When everyone's asleep, prostrate. Cry in secrecy to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. What you do, help the people less fortunate away from prying eyes. Obviously sometimes you gotta do it you know in front of people as a form of a da'wah to them but not always though, not always. Much love to our brother Sadio Mane for doing and reviving a practice of the pious scholars of the past because this is something they would do regularly. But sadly for us and it's a good reminder for me as well to do stuff like this it really humbles a person. May Allah give us all the ability to do such things and until next time guys of course Asalaamu As Alaikum.